Hello, 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 great people. Welcome back to my kitchen. You tuned in for another edition of Cooking with Love, and I'm Chef Green. So today, we're going to be making a split pea soup. Now, normally, with my leftover ham bone, I'll use it to cook my grains. But I decided, since I was supposed to make split pea soup last year when it was called, never got around to it, why not use that ham bone for that today? We're not gonna throw that bone out, but we're gonna use it. So let's get started. I will be using for this recipe, this is my leftover ham bone, some celery, onion, some vegetable broth, the, the, the split, split peas, of course, ground black pepper, bay leaves, celery salt, and some minced garlic. Now, I, I don't know that I'll need salt, but I got it the celery salt up here just in case. So what we're gonna do now is um, stop and chop our uh, onion and celery and we'll be back. As for our peas, we're gonna get those washed, filter through them, make sure we don't have no rocks or just bad peas in there. Um, we'll come back to that. But we've also, started uh we we've also cut our veggies so we're gonna get started we're gonna saute our veggies and we'll get started here i'm gonna use some olive oil in our pan to begin sauteing our veggies add in our veggies so we've added a tiny bit of garlic now we're going to add our ham bone and those pieces I'm gonna drop in a couple of bay leaves. Now we're gonna place our lid on there while we continue to wash our peas. Our water was very cloudy at first and it's starting to clear up as we wash them. I'm gonna do this a few more times, pick through, see if I see any more really dark dark, dark brown ones. We washed and washed our peas. So now we're gonna add them in to the pot. So if you'll notice the liquid level is a little taller, um, it's a little higher. And I decided to add about another um, half a container about 16 more ounces of broth so we're gonna allow it to cook and we'll be back now i'm gonna not gonna add my salt right now i need to see what it's gonna taste like after the ham has cooked a while but i will go ahead and add in some black pepper yes okay i have tasted this these uh, peas and the taste is heavenly. I gotta remember to take those bay leaves out. But oh my goodness. Like I think I'm gonna add maybe a teaspoon of uh, salt. But it tastes good. It really doesn't need very much salt at all. Oh my God, it, the taste, oh my goodness. I'll meet you guys at the dinner table. So we're back at the dinner table. And I decided to make some rice to go along with it, as well as <clears throat> some hoe cake bread. Mm -hmm. and my neighbors just fell. The flavor is like it's indescribable, but it is amazing.
I think it was that bay leaf. Or those bay leaves. Yeah. I like the skin from a ham hock or uh or from a ham. And it's cooked, fully cooked. I love it. And I have never had split pea soup. I just had a bag of split peas in the cabinet, so So I had to make it. Mm. Boy, this right here it is smashing. I love it. Thank you guys so much for watching. This has been another edition of Cooking with Love. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Leave your comments below and please share this video. And until next time, I'm Chef Green. Bye-bye.